connected with his Stradivarius tonight. Steve Shamras talked to him one on one. The Lipinski Stradivarius may be a 300 year old instrument, but somehow it keeps finding ways to surprise Frank Almond. Was it off? No. It's amazing. I mean, I don't, I, I don't understand that at all. Nearly two weeks after it was stolen, the fickle old violin was still in perfect tune. Almond drove straight from the airport today for a reunion that is hard to put in words. Even though it's a cliche, there is a kind of bond that develops that's difficult to describe. While police were piecing their case together this week, Almond was on the East Coast performing. He did not know the violin was found until just after midnight Thursday. He stepped outside a bar when strange numbers started to ring his phone. So I was at a different parking lot <laughs> getting some very good news. Suddenly, everybody was in the mood for another drink. And somehow, Frank Almond is able to put his 11 days apart from the Stradivarius into perspective. The thing's 300 years old. It's probably seen a lot worse than that. You know? Wars, revolutions, transatlantic crossings, and now a week on the run in Milwaukee. What this violin has seen only adds to its story and its beauty. In Milwaukee, Steve Shamras, today's TMJ4. And Frank Allman will perform on Monday at the Wilson Center for the Arts in Brookfield. And yes, he will play the Stradivarius.